Hi, I'm Samuel from Global Barcoding Technology, Duran Berhad. If you are interested in knowing more about our company, you can visit our official website and our Facebook page. For further inquiries, you can directly email our marketing manager, Ms. Stephanie. In this video, I want to share the SQL accounting tutorial. For today's lesson, I'm going to show you the general ledger module and we are going to look on how to maintain stock value. In order for you to maintain stock value, you need to know what's the stock value first. To do that, you have to go to the stock module. Click on the reports tab and you will find stock graph. Always remember that your stock must be up to date so that you can get the stock value accurately. Now click on it. You can leave as monthly basis or you can change it to yearly basis but normally it would be monthly. Now click apply. Click preview and OK. You can see all your items would be here and it will calculate the cost according to the costing method you have already set under the maintain stock group. If you can still remember, there are different costing methods. To see that, click on the stock tab up here and click maintain stock group. See that there are different type of costing methods. You can choose them according to which stock group you want to maintain. Right now go back. And now you have to go to the last page of this report. Alright, can you look for this number? This is the grand total of the current stock value. Alright, remember this number. And now let's go to the GL tab up here. Look for maintain stock value and click on it. Now click edit. Now remember the grand total. Put that value according to the month. Mine was June. So I'm going to put 1149937474. So this is the closing value for June. And if you can see, all the values here are closing values for the month. So for instance, how if I want to create an opening value for a month, let's say January. This is how you do it. Change the year to the year before and add the closing value to December. This is because this would eventually be the opening value for January. So let's say I'm just putting some numbers here. So this is the closing value for December which is eventually the opening value for January. So basically, this is how you maintain a stock value. That's all for today. I'm Samuel from Global Barcoding Technology, Sundrian Berhad. Thank you.